thought completely slipped my mind. I'm already playing this game for like an hour. Do you like it for the blood and such? I mean, if you like, if you like, uh, if you didn't care about, uh, I don't know, the story. I didn't like story of Elf and Elite. It was stupid. Like, let's be honest, it didn't make any sense. If you if you like gory, if you like gore, then you you can like it. But yeah. Okay, mom. See you soon. Bye. Beep. Of course, yes. Whoop in my near future. Almost makes me wish the train wouldn't come. I better get ass whooped than get killed by this weird girl. I sat my to myself as I walked over to Mia, who was sitting on nearby the bench. Oh my god, she will kill me, okay. <laughs> she's laughing at me. Uh, it appears as though Mia had regained her cheerful attitude, even though she has no home. Uh, she was clutching her school bag and rocking from side to side. Oh, she, she needs special treatment, actually. I never knew anyone who felt that good after going to the toilet. Oh, okay. I know a person that are pretty happy after going to the toilet. <laughs> Me, for example. Okay. Okay, Cyberwing. She must have had a really big bowel. It begins. I'm gonna stop myself right there. Oh, wait, okay. Uh, then it occurred to me, with everything that had happened, Mia would have missed her normal train as well. I don't know, Tamagayaki. I don't know. What is this? Okay, and she had been... She hadn't... She hadn't been to look at the schedule. Although she didn't seem at all anxious, for all I knew, her usual train hadn't even arrived yet. Maybe this was normal routine for her, that she kills me? <laughs> Wait, what, Jamie? Or maybe she was just so lost in her own world that she didn't even know where she was. Wait, wait, wait what? Okay, fuck it. She's still laughing at me, because she knows what, what will happen. Just as well as I, w I was with her at that point, if Mia was sitting by, by herself, completely unaware of her surroundings, and some perv sat down next to her, she might kill me so I can survive. Well, I didn't... Uh, sh <laughs> he, he can kill her, I mean. Well, fuck. Well, I didn't want to think about that. Why? I... I'd had more than enough lecherous thoughts for one afternoon anyway. Ground control for Major Mia. I tapped Mia lightly on the shoulder, and that was the biggest mistake I ever made. Huh? And much like Beckett's... <laughs> that was the last thing I, I ever made in my life. I ever did in my life. And much like Beckett's school, she awoke from her daydream with a small jump. Oh, that cool. Uh, what? Uh, the one and only, same exact response to. I was starting to wonder, like really, this girl, this girl needs to see a doctor. I was starting to wonder if this girl was really as introverted as everyone said she was. Perhaps she was just spacey. For example, when the other, oh my god. Yeah, let's talk about her, this girl now. Uh, for example, when the other students tried to talk to her at school, it could be that her head was in the clouds and simply didn't notice them? That could easily be misconstrued... Misconstrued? As being recalcive? Okay, I don't know this word, I don't know if this word even exists. <laughs> And that would also account for her other reputation for being of being weird. It could be that during the course of our <laughs> I can't read this. <laughs> Too many words. It could be that during the course of our belief, brief encounter, I, the new kid, managed to solve the mystery of quite a loner girl. <laughs> Too much waiting. 
I decided that I would report my finding to the other students at the school next day. Oh, so I did some research. <laughs> Everything noted on my notebook. Oh, you're leaving, Katie? She might kill me soon. I don't know. Like, she's here. Misunderstood, okay. It was possible that I would also be able to help Mia make some friends. No, fuck her. But before I could do any of that, I had to make sure that she made it home in one piece. I just checked the timetable, my train... I mean, Ducky, I will highlight this whole playthrough anyway, so yeah. I just checked that if, if you don't want to see this, so yeah. I just, I, uh, I just checked the timetable, my train will be here in about 20 minutes. See ya. Uh, have you checked uh, to see when your train arrives yet? Like, take that as no. Really, is she like my younger sister? Oh, Chan! Oh my god. Go and check, please. She can't read. Let me guess. Mia placed her bag on the seat and went to go look at the timetable. But she is advancing to the next class because she kills uh, teachers. That's a good way to get education, proper education. She will be, she she will be a president of Japan, probably. Okay, that was just weird. I felt like I was a parent. Interrogating their child about doing their homework or something. Yeah, that's what I felt. I asked Mia in soft. I know what just happened. God, all all visual novels are like this. Okay, I just said one one word. Now here comes a summary. I said one. I said hello to this girl. If she had done what she was supposed to do, she hesitated. Really? Wow, Deku, you're smart. <laughs> I asked... Okay, uh, <laughs> asked her in the same tone of voice to do as she stalled. Wow. And after more hesitating, she gave in the end... <laughs> the, oh, no. <laughs> Is this how my parents felt that they had to discipline me? Yeah, let's let's take this moment and rethink decisions in our life. What what decisions we could make different so that our lives would be better now? Let's speak about this. Let's take this this moment. Now that I'm with this girl that can kill me in, in any any moment. But... Oh wait, I think I don't know. No, but Cyberic, I'm not talking about the fact that there's a lot of talking. I'm, I'm talking about the fact that I just talked with this girl. And now I'm explaining to myself in my mind that I actually talked with a girl. Like... Okay, I talked with this girl and this is real. <laughs> I guess. Yeah, this is... I don't know. And before, like, the next question she asked me was... What I was saying in... Uh, box number 23. <laughs> or something like that. Okay. Uh, um, looked like I owned them an apology. I watched Mia examining time tables. Because of her high, she had to stand on her toes to see it properly. And I just... Look what she has under her skirt. It was funny to watch. Not, not to mention pretty cute. I don't, I don't really have an, uh, how do you call it, uh, experience in visual novels. So I don't know. I should probably stop being a jerk and go over there and actually help her. Oh, be a jerk. And before you will. Ah, uh, yeah. Maybe an extra set of eyes will help her find her train quicker. Yeah, it's like, this is, 
this is uh, like the main reason I I, I kind of stopped watching anime because main characters are wusses. I don't like I really don't like that. I really don't like harem harem anime. Just because of this fact. So so many ac like ecchi anime. I don't really like I, I I watched like a lot of those and I'm I'm really annoyed by that this kind of characters. That just can't grab a pair of tits. <laughs> okay, well. Uh, I got up and walked over to her. Russell, Russell. I was apparently going through grass. Then I remember her school bag was sitting next to me. I turned back and saw that it had fallen off the seat and some things had fallen out of it. Maybe some, probably ma machetes. Knives. <laughs> but. Again, apparently this girl was not in the habit of closing her bag properly. I bent down and started putting the items back into her bag. <gasps> Told you, there is a machete. And then something caught in my eye. There was a... <laughs> two, two meters katana. Amongst the spilled content was a calculator that I accidentally broke and disposed of. What on the earth was doing in back in Mia's bag? <gasps> oh god. No. She took that calculator with her. Let me guess, she'll kill me with that calculator now? She didn't. Back at school when she said she needed to use the toilet. Could it be that when she finished, she snuck back into the classroom and took the calculator out of the trash? Who cares? <laughs> she's, she's crazy, we already know this. Please, don't, don't sum things up. The story plays out. You would hate me, right, Nikki? <laughs> Probably. It's also possible that she never even needed to use the toilet to begin with. <gasps> I'm a detective now. Perhaps she simply made up an excuse so that I would leave and she could sneak in and take it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Wait, what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's art, damn it, art. <laughs> Could we give it the time she started getting <laughs> quiet? <laughs> what when I disposed of the calculator? I mean, I should like use this moment and kill her first. This is basically what I should do, but hey. I'm just dumb. I'm just I'm just horny little like teenage boy. I'm horny teenage boy. When I was brushing the dirt of her, the direction she was studying in was the classroom where I disposed of it. Oh my god, please. Will this like help me in the story or something? I don't know. And the time that she started behaving happily again was after she came back from the toilet? <gasps> Of course! Do I win this game right now? It all, it all made sense now! Yes! For some unknown reason, Mia really wanted her calculator back, regardless of its condition. Why is that? <laughs> Wouldn't it improve the situation? Oh, all the pieces were falling into place. Sort of. Let me guess, or her family is psychic and their family will chase me. <laughs> I don't know. But why would she hide it from me? <sighs> uh, I'm not gonna even comment on this. More importantly, <laughs> sh would she lie to me in order to retrieve it? Mm. Why would anybody lie to the fact that they like... We're taking some trash of the trash can because they need it. Why didn't she just ask me to give it back to her instead of letting me toss it away? Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Jamie, I can't do this. <laughs> I can't really do this. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I 
Yeah, facade playthrough was awesome. <laughs> facade playthrough was awesome. Uh, yeah, why didn't she just ask me to give it back to her instead of letting me toss it? Okay, I, I already read that. Was it really that precious to her? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is too much. This is too much for me already. <laughs> oh, okay, <laughs> this came too good. Okay, I'm sorry, Cyberring, but okay, I don't want to bash your choice in game and stuff like that. I'm just, I'm just annoyed by this, this summary fact. This, this, the fact that I'm pretending that I'm smart, repeating the same shit all over again. But for all I knew, it was a gift from a loved one that she cherished with all her heart. Oh God, now, now it's like, she must really love me. Wow, I guess I really didn't have any right to just throw it away without asking her first. I decided to put it back and pretend that I didn't see anything. Good, I should do this earlier. Given the circumstances, it was the least I could do. What the? As I went back in the back, I felt something slimy on my fingers. Ugh. <laughs> That's precious. Okay. I looked at my hand and saw that it was covered with... covered in a clear liquid. No. No. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> when did that happen? <laughs> they get s spit on at some point. What the hell is with some people? As I recalled in disgust, I dropped calculator back on the ground. I leaned in to pick it up. Let me guess, she was in the toilet and she was... <laughs> you hear spoilers behind the wall. And she was... She was enjoying herself using this calculator. <laughs> the nose screaming. And then I noticed something. Okay, that's bizarre. No shit! The calculator also had saliva on it. Oh, okay. So, well, sorry that I spoiled the game. Now we will get thousands of uh, text boxes about this. Every inch of it, mind it. Okay, <laughs> it looked more like it had originated from a broken screen that it and then ran down when the calculator was tilted upwards. But even so, there was a lot of it. Wow. It was as if someone had been making out... Oh my god. Like one of those really steamy movies that mommy doesn't know I watch. The real question was, was it me and Saliva? No, it was fucking Principal Saliva, probably. <laughs> or did it get onto the calculator because of something else that was also in the trash? that just happened to have saliva on it. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. A lot of kids threw their food warper... <laughs> I know, this is obvious. <laughs> Stop into the trash at lunch today. Okay, so Deku... De apparently, Deku needs special treatment. Deku is really dumb in this game. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry. And some kids were pretty keen on licking up every last crumb on <laughs> They threw them away. Okay, maybe it came from one of those. <laughs> Just not the way you're thinking. I know she she was make a making out of it. I know. I mean, who knows? Maybe it wasn't really saliva. It wasn't above the realm of possibility, but wait. I couldn't remember whenever or not the trash bag had been replaced before I disposed cake later. Wait, what? Oh my god, and now I'm thinking, maybe the, maybe Trashkin was never there. <gasps> maybe I was never in this school. 
Oh shit! Mind blown! Deku! What? <laughs> Cyberwing? Yeah, we... <laughs> what the hell? We all know this? Cyberwing? I spun around to find Mia standing over me. When did she get there? She teleported, obviously. She must have had a stealth of a cat. Oh my god! She had special abilities. She's X-Men. Uh, she's mutant. My train arrives in 18 minutes. Huh? You can read? Wow. Alright, great. Deck you, damas. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the first thing I, I said, like, I can agree with myself. At least try to remember what were you doing beforehand so you can avoid looking suspicious. What is the delay for you guys anyway? Can you just test it? I'm just wondering, just just curious. I quickly stuffed the calculator into my blazer pocket. Given its condition, that probably wasn't the best move. Wow, okay. Cool. What are you doing on the floor with my school bag? I'm making out with it like you did with my calculator. <laughs> oh, this. It fell down and I was just uh, picking it up for you, I guess. I stood up and handed her the bag. Around 80 seconds? Wait, what? Something's really wrong. Like, really fucking lo wrong. Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck is this paint doing here? Wait, do I have anything opened that... Oh, wait, this shit. Maybe this shit? It's... It's... Internet? Okay, so I've been handed her the bag. <laughs> okay. Mm. <laughs> He's drinking off into Mia's bag. <laughs> yes. That's what I fucking like. You make out of my calculator, eat that bitch! Ah! <laughs> she had a dubious look in her eye. I hope that she didn't feel the need to verify that everything was there. Okay, she looks she looks like Ah oh, Deku, you done goofed. I will have to kill you now. <laughs> Deku is so nice. Okay. He's always looking out for me. I'm always looking out for you. Can you say you? Okay. Oh. I leave for a minute. Oh. Okay. That's bad. That's bad. Good stuff happened. Some funny stuff. You can you can check it in the chat. Probably. I'm so happy. Mia took the bag and hugged it tightly. <laughs> and then my... Oh, I'm not gonna say it, okay. <laughs> no doubt because she assumed that the calculator was still in there. I will fucking make out of this calculator when I go back home. L little did she know that it wasn't... It was currently in my pocket. Maybe she did know. Who knows? I think you should do some more research about this. Uh, yeah, that that's me, all right, Mr. Nice Guy, <laughs> Mr. Creep. <laughs> I stole it away from her a uh, second time. Some nice guy. I so nice. Oh my God! Are you? Am I like really feel bad because I took this girl's? broken calculator. Sure, I took it out spontaneously, but that was no excuse. Wow. I will... I need to go confess my sins, apparently. I will talk about this... I will talk about this calculator for for 10 minutes, so guys, I don't know, you can leave. Yeah, it was slimy broken calculator. Exactly. So, uh, you said... And I put it in my pocket, obviously. 
because she wanted to kill me. Yeah, I don't how I don't know how you handle Yandere. So uh, you said your train was ways off as well, right? Well, in that case. <gasps> wow, how do I handle this girl? <laughs> she will kill me with broken calculator, right? <coughs> okay, I believe that you... You thirsty is the thing I should say. Wait, no, it's not even proper English. I mean, she's not black. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, but uh, probably Cy Cyberwing w w <laughs> would said, "Yo, you first, <laughs> you firsty girl, you firsty girl, damn girl." There is something I want to talk to you about. Wait, can I press like escape button? I try it. Yes. Okay. I save with escape button. Yes. Yes, okay, okay. Uh, save. Here. Yes. Previous. Wait, what? Oh, it has artist auto saves. Oh. Okay, I'm not gonna look at the chat because I know you, you guys, you guys are probably spoiling. The sp Cyberwing is probably spoiling. It's like. Maybe I'll choose there is something I want to talk to you about, about your saliva. Uh, the food end? The food end? She's going to eat. <laughs> She's going to eat me. <laughs> Yes, every guy, girl, you thirsty. <laughs> There's something I want to talk about you. Huh? Who was I kidding? I don't want to talk about this. I want to cause this girl any more grief. It was the time to be a man and come clean. I sat back on the bench. Mia placed her bag and sat beside me. Then I reached in my pocket and pulled out the calculator. Wow. Okay. Wh why do you... It fell off your back while you were over at the timetables. I meant to put it back, but when you come back, I get nervous and stuff it in my pocket. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mia. I didn't mean to cause you kill me. I know my actions were bad, and now you will kill me. But please, do it so that it doesn't hurt. I had no idea this calculator was so important to you. I should have asked you before I went and threw it away. Okay, why am I even talking? This girl is probably not even listening to me. She's probably uh, thinking like, hmm, do I...